At least that's my animal. Gonna need to figure out a way to break that alliance with France, though. Or just be a man and fight them at the same time. <laughs> That'd be pretty glorious. Ah! Finally! We see something down. Now let's go down here because these... Oh, no. We're just, uh... Wreck shit to pieces and... In terms. How's Africa doing, though? Ah, pretty good, pretty good. We're getting it done. We're getting it done. This one's gonna be done soon, and then... yeah, we can take this for almost free. It's pretty good because uh, you know we... this land. I want that merchant that that gives, as well as the event. The events are really good too. What the fuck's going on over here? I guess we just ran into something. Oh god, no. How expensive is it to support those? Ugh. Oh. Well, I'm gonna kill those. Just fuck that. Doing the light song. Good points. <sighs> oh, of course they succeed at fucking 14% to be expected, I suppose. Got C nade out. these cannons in there. And the rest of those are gonna go occupy the rest of this crap. I don't really care about this. I guess it's like half a war score or something. It might just... All of those shitty things add up, man. Oh god. We're stuck. Mm, I think we'll still win. No, oh, it's close call though. Close fucking goal. No, we're gonna lose that. Oh! We won! Close goal. I need to time this a little bit, because I'm pretty sure those will arrive f Oh no, they don't. Well, who am I allied with? Uh, Austria and Russia. But uh, Russia isn't... Well, I suppose they're making their way. But they uh, they collapsed, the rebels, because they're just stupid. Russia's really weak now, because they there's no way Russia makes enough money to fortify all of its land. And the AI that doesn't fortify his land is just gonna die. Instantly. Okay, got Kef down. Let's get one of these armies back into Southern Africa. And one of them can stay here. I think the Ottoman separatists won't fire for some time because they recently fired, right? Yeah. That revolt risk, though. That fucking revolt risk. Sick. That's actually sick. Oh, looks like I'll have a job to do on the way. 
Not all of that's being covered by forts. Yes, it is. I'll have to re rearrange that later. By the time we get there. So. I like how he decides to walk back when that happens. I'm pretty surprised that he does that, actually. Oh god. No! Uh. No! Oh! Oh, this is- oh, this is- Oh. I thought I was building those in the wasteland just now. You really should have taken the defensive ideas, plus 20 religious units. Yeah. Defensive ideas are shit though. Like, I need more men, I need manpower, or I need army tradition, because that's basically the same thing. So, defensive ideas, uh, I don't like defensive ideas. I really don't. See their uh, quantity. Quality or offensive for me. Offensive is just so shit. Okay. Portugal. Here's what I want of you. I want the Grain Coast. I want Caru. I want Sierra Leone. That thing. That thing. That thing. The rest of that I don't really care about because it's not in the trade company. So why the fuck would I care? Um, I do want Kota though, definitely, and uh, Jiao, Jiao Jiao Miao Kiao, yes, Contour, no no no, we don't care about any of that other crap, we, we want to annoy his treaties with, do I want him to annoy his treaties with Kisti, ah, don't know. See how badly annoyed people get when I take uh, Lisboa. Oh, he doesn't even want to give me that. Wow. What about just Porto then? That's fine. Yeah, no, this is fine. Oh, hold on. There we go. Yeah, this is perfect. I can immediately start getting claims on it. Oh. I'll watch this one take forever now. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, what the fuck, dude? That is so fucking stupid. Ah, that is so stupid in so many fucking ways. Oh my god. That is so dumb. Meanwhile, Portugal has a 666 king. Really? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that is, that is pretty good. Hmm. 
How come your in-game music sounds so awesome? Because I've got the... The thingy mod. Ah, we got Kef down. Perfect. Because I've got the thingy mod. The, the guns, drums, and steel mod. Yeah. At least they're good for something. It's DLC. 11 out of 6 relations. Yep. I need every bit of them, I think. Well, maybe not Naples. That other thing. What's it called? The poop. Maybe not that, those. The other ones. Jen. I don't need Jenna anymore. Or Morocco. Tell you what I do need though. I definitely need a fleet. Also, this is such bullshit. Like, why do I have a fort here? This makes no sense. Let's destroy that. And this fort makes no sense either, so let's destroy that. Now, if we can get a fort in uh, this province, we'll have this entire. We'll have that entire area fortified, is what I was gonna say. Before the rebels uh, destroyed my. Can I get a fucking good leader, please? Oh my god. So sick. So sick. Of the non stop fighting wars, and I can't get anything decent. <laughs> Army tradition is such a dick these days. Huh. Army tradition is such a pain in the cock to get. That is amazing. That is actually amazing. I am impressed, game. I am truly impressed. Alright, let's go fight uh, thingy boggles. That no leader Spanish army over there. It's gonna give me some war score. We're still improving relations with you, I am. Uh, or did I quit halfway through? Converted Zanzibar. Mombasa is next. Ah, oh, he's stuck. Never mind. I would have wanted him to recover some of his morale, but I—he he, got—he uh, got stuck too fast. Flory, do you have the King of Mercury achievement? Uh, no. no. It's like play as a uh, thingy and own Zanzibar or something. Oh yes! Let's go pay back all of our loans. <laughs> Gold rush. We're gonna get that event a lot. And this is gonna do wonders for our war score too. I don't think he can run away that far. Well, maybe he can run away to Azov. Possibly. That could be a thing. Nope. So he's dead now. We'll go ahead and unseat Zav. Well, first off, let's unseat Dern, because that's some fucking bullshit. And you can go do this and deal with those. Definitely want to continue to pay war taxes. Call for peace, I think. Yeah, call for peace. 
But we're fine for now. We are coring everything, right? And we won't piece them out until October 83. And by that time, I will have... I, I do kind of want to, to have won the war. But uh, Castile only has three forts left. And those aren't those weird-ass fucking level 6 forts. So we can siege those down in like a couple of months. That shouldn't be that big of a problem. Now, did I remember to add all this to a trading company? I definitely did not. And that's, I think, going to give me a merchant straight away. No, 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 because we don't own any of the... Fuck. We don't own any of the trading provinces themselves. Like, most of this is being owned by Holland. So. Yeah. And I've been thinking, I, I wanted to take these provinces before, but I've changed my mind on that completely. Because the Cape is... If I conquer the Cape and add that to a trading company, it's going to give me a merch. Ah, there's gold mines here. No, we're going to have to go take that. Fuck that. Those gold mines are mine. <laughs> those gold mines are mine. I'm taking all those gold mines. So I won't, I won't add that to a trading company then. And I will have to take uh, Portugal and uh, thingy out there. Ah, see it's Madrid down. Let's rack them up, boys. Rack them up. Let's get two of these cannons. And put them into Sevilla. Let's get this done. Lickety split. You hate. And as a Dutch, you don't want to fight Holland. Oh, yes, I do. What about the pile of gold? You? Oh, you can bet. Ah, I've got that one. <laughs> I'm addicted to gold, dude. Gold is great. Free inflation for the win. I figured this war would last for a long time. I was right on that one. War is going to be over in eight months, so we kind of need to hurry up. Or the war should be over in eight months, so we kind of need to hurry up. By the time that army gets there, um, it'll, it'll, it will have recovered, so. Gold is love, gold is life. You know. But we st we want to take this, so twenty three. Really? Uh, thought it was twenty two. Well, never mind then. I think La Mancha is a gold province, yes. Didn't it used to be Toledo? Well, I don't know. They changed everything, so. But I, I want uh, most of Europe to stay overseas for now, uh, whatever. Because these provinces are super expensive, so. Spain, you worthless piece of ass.
Oh no, don't tell me. Okay. Oh no, no, we're still gonna have to siege this up. I'm sorry, but this is part of the trading company, and I'll be damned if I don't get that, so we're gonna get that. I'll be damned if I don't get that. That will be so stupid. Oh, it's level 6. Okay, never mind. We'll get it in some different war. Oh. Oh, we still need to wait until October anyway, but we're not gonna have that province seat stop in time. So. Kinda shitty, ladies and gentlemen. Kinda shitty. But nonetheless, 11th of October is gonna be the glorious time for peace. Spain. Here's the deal. I want Tunis. What the f- Oh, right. We want Tunis. We want Tlemchen. I want Syracuse. Oh, you won't give Palermo to me? Uh, that's... Okay, just fine. Give me Messina then. That's good enough. Is it? The culture converted that. Shit. Did he culture convert this? Oh, he did! Such bastard, much wow. Uh -oh. I mean, I guess I can take that, but still, it's really lame. Could humiliate them. Release Leon. I don't want to get any vassals right now, because I kind of want to wait until Tech 23 and then get myself a client state. Ah, uh, but that would take such a long ass fucking time. I don't even know how I'm going to use client states for this properly, because, you know, client states kind of bad. I would like to humiliate them, though. Uh, I don't need to humiliate them. There's no, there's no need. Let's just take Tlemkin, Tunis, and Messina. So I have ourselves a landing point. Do I... I could do this, you know. Hold on, hold on here. Hold the phone. Let's just take 100% and see what we can get. Definitely a hundred and ten. Four. Can't ask for no more island hopping required, guys. Look at the I this is some glorious shit. You can take all of their Oh my god, I can take all of their fucking islands. Look at this. No more island hopping. No more motherfucking island hopping. Well no, no, that's not true because you really do need to go over there. Wait, do I? Let's check. Clang. No! Only if they build a fort here. 
Only if they build a fort here. That that's when you need to go occupy that. Look at this. They don't have any forts on those. You can just take all that. Oh, look at this gloriousness. Look at this gloriousness. Ah. Oh, I don't even. Oh, guys, you don't even know how glorious this is. <laughs> can I add that to a trading company? I can. I can, and it would help out too. Oh boy. Oh boy. I think I'm losing my priorities here, though. I think I'm losing my priorities here, but still, that. Is this part of a trading company, too? No, probably not, right? Ooh, that's not part of a trading company. This is, though. Ah, uh, But we'd have to go fight uh, the Malakas for that. Like, uh, fucking uh, Malaysia. I mean, if we really wanted these provinces, we could, we could go get them. They're, they're, not, they're not my main concern here. My main concern is getting the goals that we wanted to get. So let's just stick to the plan, man. Stick to the fucking plan. Let's see. Anything 9 over extension. I took a take Alicia, not release it. Then just take Asturias and Leon. And this or that. And a couple dockets. Sure. Yeah, well, I welcome. They, they're certainly welcome to try to fight me in Austria. That's perfectly reasonable. Now, let's go ahead and release uh, fucking Leon as my trusty vassal. We should have exactly 100%. We do. Oh, this is super cheap because it's overseas. So, pretty cool stuff. <sighs> yeah, too bad we couldn't ask for this. That's kind of sucks. But now that we have all of the provinces in Africa that we want to get, we can finally start integration of Syria. Which I can't wait for that to finish. It's going to cost me 1,746 diplomatic points. Uh, let me just go ahead and get myself a... Let me just go ahead and get myself a calculator, but because it's not going to cost me that much. It's going to cost me significantly less. Calculator. Oh, fuck off, will ya? Okay, so right now it's costing me... 1700 diplomatic points. 1,364, but I get a discount because I've got this. Ugh, that's saying 25 discount. So this is 75. So we need to get 1,746 and then divide that by 75 and then do that times 100. Okay, so it's that much. And then we divide that by 100 again and do it times 20. It's 165. This would be a 20% discount. So then we take. Let me get a pen. So I'm going to forget about that number. Oh, that's. Uh, I feel such in a rumba right now. 465.6. Well, we'll call it 467. So then we take. Uh, let's close this. One. 746 new uh, minus 467 1279 so at 1279 when we have this at 1279 uh, we're going to activate this policy right here diplomatic annexation cost negative 20 it 
uh, gets applied retroactively, or rather it subtracts the 20% off of the annexation progress, and it uh, reduces the, the standard cost. Now, because we already had a discount, we shouldn't take 1746 because then we would get the wrong numbers. We need to use the base numbers. The base number was uh, 2300 something something. So at 1279 points, we're going to activate this. And then we're going to instantly finish the integration of Syria. So we save ourselves 500 points there. Anyway. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe. And if you're watching this on Twitch, stay right there. I'll be right back. But uh, I'm going to go have a smoke. Also, go to my YouTube channel and subscribe. There's a... This entire playthrough is being uploaded there as we speak. Got ourselves some nice Zoroastrian Empire. Ah. Yeah. So, yeah. Anyway, I'll be right back, guys.